Hey, hey, Flamingo friends. Hey, hey, I wanted to uh, just quickly go over real quick that Google Doc that's on the Google Classroom. Uh, you can click on that Google Doc and edit under your child's name or your child can find their name even and, and, and edit the invention brainstorming ideas that they have. And then after you're done, if you want to print that out, you can make it into a PDF to print out uh, and then uh, they can cut the invention ideas and put one one on each of the last four pages of their sketchbook and then illustrate it. Um, but if you fill it in on that page, it's really nice uh, because uh, then we can all see each other's ideas and be inspired and learn from one another. Um, thank you to all of those who have contributed. You can also upload photos of your child's drawing um, by completing the assignment. Um, Lindsay Rouse did that and it was so cool to grade Libby's assignment. Libby, you did a great job and, and you're doing such useful things right now with your inventions. It's awesome. Um, and so if you wanna do that, you totally can. Um, that might be a fun way to interact as well, putting pictures of your child's illustrations and work on there. Um, and uh, I wanted to read this fun book called uh, Cooper and Nickel, Copper Nickel rather, Copper Nickel, The Invention. Go outside and run around, says Tungsten. I don't have time for that right now, Coppernickel replies. I'm too, re re too busy reading about all of the inventions that have ever been made. It's really interesting. Come on and take a look. Wow, look at this sketchbook. Lots of drawings, lots of written descriptions of different inventions. Hey, the last page is blank. That means there's still room for something new to be invented. Tungsten, come on, let's make our own invention now. It shouldn't be that hard. We just have to come up with something that no one's ever thought of before. Something simple and really useful. I got it. I'll make a machine for picking high hanging elderberries. Oh, that would be good for right now. Elderberry syrup keeps us healthy build our immune system. It will have a special extending elderberry gripper and wheels so that it can go anywhere at all. I'm almost finished. Look at my drawing. It just needs a steering wheel to turn it around since elderberries grow all over the bush. I guess the steering wheel will uh, just have to go maybe right here, right about there, yeah. A rotating berry fork would also come in handy, and a pair of high-hanging elderberry feelers, and a bramble bush stepper with thorn-resistant telescoping legs, and an elderberry juice juggler with beak-shaped extensions, and a berry chute with an automatic branch separator with an elderberry gripper. I'm going to get all your elderberries. <laughs> Look at this invention idea. Wow. And this is the elderberry detector device. Hey, keep off my paper. Tungsten pushes the elderberry detector de device away. And slowly, one gear begins to turn, followed by another gear, and then another. Everything starts to crunch, squeak, huff, spin, bump, hiss, whistle, and swing, and the elderberry gripper moves toward copper nickel. Whoa, stop. I am not a high-hanging elderberry, shouts Coppernickel, but the gripper already has taken a hold of him. Help, Tungsten, do something, do something. Tungsten pulls one of the levers, a simple machine. The gripper carries Coppernickel high into the air and Tungsten quickly pushes the lever back into place. At this, as the, at the, this the gripper opens, dropping Coppernickel down onto the conveyor belt. Tungsten pulls another level, ne lever and now it's a berry claw that grabs hold of copper nickel. Tungsten quickly shifts all of the levers to off, causing the claw to release copper nickel right over the elderberry chute. Oh. Look at this. Pull the emergency brake, shouts copper nickel. Tungsten hesitates. Not that thing between the big toothy cogs, is that it? Hurry, I'm falling off of the elderberry crusher, yells Copper Nickel. Now, pull it, pull it. Tungsten pulls the brake. 
The machine makes a loud screeching noise and it shivers to a stop. Copper nickel tumbles out. Maybe the elderberry detector device needed to be adjusted. Copper nickel quickly pulls his invention off of the wall. Look at him pulling his drawing off of the wall. What did you think up, Tungsten? I think it's some sort of clever, useful stick, Tungsten says. I just don't know exactly what it's for, though. I know, shouts Copper Nickel. It's perfect for picking high-hanging elderberries. Come on, let's go try it out now. Finally, they're doing what Tungsten had wanted to do all along, and it's great to be outside. The Nickel Stick, invented by Copper Nickel and Tungsten. I hope you're inspired to do all of your drawings of your invention brainstorming ideas in your sketchbook. Uh, and that will conclude our sketchbook. So be thinking, be thinking, 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 thinking about which one of your ideas, we're gonna pick one idea for next week because we're gonna start to develop it. And we're gonna make a set of plans for that idea. And then we're gonna build a prototype, which is a model of an invention and we're going to have an invention convention. We're gonna have one. Uh, uh, we're going to do it either virtually on our phones, our invention convention, or maybe just maybe, we'll all be back together again and we'll have an invention convention together. I miss you all, I miss you all. See you soon.